Alright guys, so as you can see, there's a bunch of stuff behind me because we've been going crazy lately, but quick note, I want to show you guys what I am selling this Valentine's Day, and I'm going to upload this today. Uh, I know I'm sorry that you guys are seeing this maybe a little bit too late. I've been really busy because this Valentine's Day has been going crazy, but... I want to show you guys what I'm selling, how much profit I'm making, and give you guys some ideas of what you can sell for Valentine's Day, too, because I know there isn't any video out there on how to sell candy, you know, during Valentine's Day. Like, what do you make? What do you do? What is there? So we're going to be going into all of that, the best candy to sell, how you can make it, and let's go ahead and get into it. Make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video. I love you guys. Peace out. Yes. <laughs> I'm feeling kind of sick, but uh, I put a bunch of Valentine's Day presents in this duffel bag. So even if I, you know, if you say, oh, you're carrying duffel bag, what's in it, what's in it? Just open it, no candy, I'm not bringing any candy with me. Of course, I got something in my backpack. But uh, guys, we're all in here, I'm gonna show you for you. As you can see, I got it in there. guys we are back at the crib from someone at high school now we did not sell that much because i had to bring so much stuff for the valentine's day but we are ready to sell for sure after school so let's go ahead and get over there because we got to go sell out to high school let's get it y'all let's get it all right we are at the high school location as you can see they are coming in the back that's what we got for sales today let's see how sales how much are they everything in here is a dollar to get it it's free all right um can i get two watermelons Alright. Two tropical starbursts. And sour gummy worms. There you are, man. How are we going? The usual. The usual. Alright. Yeah. Alright. Alright. Have a good day. I want one Skittle. Skittle. Huh? Why don't you just pay him? Because. He doesn't, he doesn't, he doesn't, he doesn't want any transactions for cash. Hey. Coming this we got. Let's see how sales go. Honey bun, honey bun. Which one? 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 Which all right, we at the middle school. As you can see, they come in. So we got to sell today. Let's see how sell. All right, so oh, you should all. Yes, sir. Today was a wonderful day. Sales were a little bit low because of Valentine's Day and the end flood of all the free candy, but it was still an amazing day. You know what? I love everybody. Make sure you check out those links in the description. Peace. Love you. Goodbye. Subscribe. Whoa, 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 whoa.
stop. This is not another ad, but, but guys, I want you to go ahead and click the link in the description below right now because right now you can get on a VIP waiting list for the new course that I am about to drop coming soon. There's be more information about the people it's helped, how it's increasing sales, you know, a lot of different things that you're going to want to know about. And if you really think my content has helped you and you want to get more, you know, take it to the next level and really break that $100 a day mark or just find out some other things that's really going to help you take your snacks only to the next level, go ahead and click that link in the description below and I'll be sending something to your inbox pretty soon. Go ahead guys. Alright, so this is what this one looks like. Oh man, it, it is a little rough because it's, it's homemade. Uh, Alright. This is what it looks like. And you can see that one. Yeah. Uh, uh, so it's just like a few things like that. And uh, like this little section right here. You can get that with the damage. But uh, this right here. set with all of this defects and blemishes or you can trade this out for another one which would be this you can see this one right here if you press this it lights up it's a really cool rose and this got the teddy bear here some lifesavers uh thank you I'm pretty sure it's a thank you is that a thank you card no notepad. notepad yeah uh king size twigs teddy bear like i said it also comes with like this little small box it's a sour patch kids the rose of course the twigs king size uh caramel pop part caramel popcorn and a balloon So what I have behind me is amazing because this is exactly what I've been selling this Valentine's Day. I'm going to show you how I sell it and what I sold. Now, let's get into the first thing. This right here was all made very cheap. You can go to a few places to make this. And the first place I want to start off by telling you is Dollar Tree. Make use of Dollar Tree. Now, all of this stuff was handmade. For this one example, we got a dollar. Like this came from the Dollar Tree. For This came from the Dollar Tree. And then these came from the Dollar Tree. And then, of course... There are twits in there. All right, so the first thing we start off with is heart. This is a regular shoe box. We put, uh, I forgot what type of paper this is, but it's tissue paper. We put tissue paper on top of it, all over it. Uh, these are little puff balls you can get from arts and craft stores. Uh, this is a little t uh, heart. Look at that. It's so cool, right? Then next thing we have is some caramel popcorn that uh, came in a pack that was $5 for like, I think like 12 of them or 15 of them, a bunch of them. We got Twix in here, some uh, small pieces of candy, and some blow pops. And you can go off. We found this at Dollar Tree. We got a big box of these at Sam's Club. And we got this at Dollar Tree, too. And this, you know, we, uh, for this one, we, we, we uh, like, glued, hot glued. We used hot glue to hot glue this right here on the back of the Twix to make it a little heart, all right? And then we put some hay and some more. You get this at Dollar Tree, too, or Arts and Crafts Store. It's not that much. Uh, we use this at the Dollar Tree as well to put it on the bottom just to make it look nice, you know. And this is what they get. And you just take a picture of it. I put it on my social media, and this is what it looks like. As you can see, it looks... We did sell this. We sold this for five, uh, for fifteen dollars. It took around seven dollars to make, so it's about an eight dollar profit right there off of this. This was handmade, and you know what? On Valentine's Day, people will buy it. So So right behind me here, I have these little baskets. Oh, 
they're so cute, right? So I have these little baskets that we made. Uh, we're gonna go over in these. Call we sell these for around fifteen dollars each. Also, we already sold one pre-order. I did pre-orders. Uh, bring it on Valentine's Day and give it to them and everything, right? So let's go get deeper into. It. As you can see, uh, this one has the Snickers, and the way we did this was very easy. We just took, like, we got some of these from the Dollar Tree, right? And we took them and hot glued them on the end of the Snickers, right? And you can pick up a huge box of Snickers. When I went to go restock, I got a huge box of these from uh, from Sam's, right? And so what we did was instead of making it like, uh, you know, we didn't have any Snickers specifically valentine's day themed candy so what we did was we put little chocolate hearts on the side of them right this one specifically came with some sweet hearts in it uh sweet tarts uh, it's got a little teddy bear and at the bottom you know this right here is just all plastic dump this out you can get this this uh most of the stuff we found at the dollar tree if this thing will come out uh so this is tissue paper as well and we just usually we took a uh, plastic wrap that was like a uh, heart, so it's like uh, you get it like this kind of, but it's like plastic, and it's at the Dollar Tree, and we just took it and wrapped up around a bunch of like paper and as a base, so we can use it as a base. And the most important thing is you want to set it on top of the base so people can see it when you take the picture because they're buying the display, they're not buying what's in it, right? And so what we did was after we made that base, we went ahead and put <laughs> some, some red, uh, some red uh, tissue paper at the sweet tart. Boom. Oh, no. Oh, we're going to have to fix that. My bad. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to fix that. All right. And then, boom, like that. People like it. We sell it for $15. That easy. So, 15 This costs around about one, two, three, four, five. Wait, one, two, three. I think it costs around four or five dollars. So, we're making about, let me see, ten, anywhere from nine, eight, ten dollar profit off of these. And we did the same one for this one. These little strawberries, you can get like a whole huge pack of them. But for this one specifically, we hot glued them to this base. And the way you make these bases is they, uh, you can get this at Dollar Tree. It's like this little, uh, green thing that's like you can just stick stuff in it. It's really soft. And we got a Twix in here as well with some, uh, suckers in the back. And we hot glued some of this too as well. And this is just a rose you can get. So this took around, uh, seven dollars to make. So this is a little bit less profit. But as well, we're still making a lot of profit on these. Uh, this is fifteen dollars as well. And we sold two of them together. So one of these did sell. I'm not sure which one it was. I have to go back and look. One of these did sell. Uh, so let's get into Like I said, we got the popcorn. We, as you can see, we uh, hot glued this on here to make it look a little bit nice. And let me just take this off for a second because we did sell this one. We got this at the Dollar Tree. Like I said, the tissue paper. There is a base on the bottom, like that green thing I was telling you you can get. Boom. We got some blow pop suckers. We just put some caramel in the middle. You know, and you get these plastic uh, clear things. You can get these at the Dollar Tree as well. Oh, I need to put this back in there. Uh, I get it later, but yeah, this costs around seven dollars to make. We sell it for fifteen, um, so that's another profit right there, uh, eight dollar profit. Yeah, and then over here, as you can, very important, get the balloons. Got to get the balloons, and we stick it in there, right? And we used hay for the bottom. You got this container at Dollar Tree, okay? We got uh, we use the container. At the, we fill it with hay at the bottom, tissue paper on top. As you can see, we hot glued these right here on the outside of the tissue paper. We put the caramel popcorn in there. Uh, here goes another one of these little things like chocolate. And then we just put some uh, suckers in there. And we sell these for 15 bucks. So it's really easy to make, guys. You just got to have a little bit of patience. And you got to go out there and get the supply. Here we cost about four dollars to make. We sell them for around seven. So four minus seven, it's about two dollar profit. So wait, no, I don't think it costs four dollars. Let me see. One, uh, two, one, two, three. Yeah, it's about four dollars profit. Three, four dollars. So and we sell them for seven. So yeah, it's about two or three dollars profit on these little boxes right here. Uh, let's get into it a little bit. That's it. Like these, these are twenty five cent each. These little things are probably like a nickel or maybe less than that. Probably like a penny because you get a whole bunch of them for a dollar. A uh, little chocolate, same thing. Uh, suckers, we got like seven suckers. 
<laughs> so we probably got like two of them. But uh, as you can see, we just put tissue wrapper on the bottom, and we have like a little base that's like green that uh, you can pick up at Dollar Tree. It's like the one where you squeeze it, it like starts to come in. It's a little bit styrofoam. We got these little baggies that they go in. We got a whole bunch of these. We got like eight of these for a dollar, right? So maybe this costs less than a dollar, probably like $3, all right? And then we did the same thing for this one. I don't really want to take the bag out, but uh, we just got a little container. Uh, this is some ribbons right here. Uh, we put some M&Ms in there, that's cute. And we got two blow pops, right? And then over here, it's kind of this, it's the exact same thing as this one with the Snickers and the suckers uh, and everything in there. And we just put a little baggie to make it look cuter. I know it knocked over. Oh my gosh. Uh, and yes, two of these sold. No, one of these sold. Okay. One of these sold. Yeah. One of these sold. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> we gotta go back. Have to go back. We have to go back and look at the order, but these do sell, guys. Right behind me, I have these bags that sell for 20 bucks each. They cost about, it cost us about $10, I believe, to make. Maybe less than that. So it's around $10 more profit. But these right here, this one is in plastic. This one isn't in plastic. The reason you want to buy these little plastic things that you see you put ribbons on them, you know, some stuff like that heart shape because it looks nicer when it's in the plastic. Plus, people can see it. It's easier to handle it when you bring it to school. Now, over here, this is the same exact bag as this one, except one's in plastic, one is not. Over here, we have like we made use of these things very easily. A lot of you'll see a reoccurring theme. This is a little bit bigger piece of chocolate. We put a little teddy bear in here, a little happy Valentine's Day thingy. Uh, attached to some M&M's and the way we did that we just, oh my god it just came off yeah we're gonna have to hot glue that back uh, so it just ah oh, Jesus crap dang it so as you can see on the bottom is a, a base we just use a base and the way we create those bases I took some of my old boxes that I don't sell candy anymore I cut it in half and put it on the bottom so it holds this up and we need to fix that ASAP so pull this out so I can fix that and in the back, we just use some really glittery, sparkly tissue paper. And literally, this doesn't take much to make. And this is the exact same thing, except this one, you know, we had some ribbons on the top, a balloon in there. And it's the way you decorate it that what sells it, guys. That's the most important thing that's key to doing all this. Behind me, this one, this box came for free from Dollar Tree, so... Kudos to Dollar Tree for giving us the box free. Uh, like I said, the bear was a dollar. These little things right here on the side are 25 cents. You know, the rose came in a pack, so that was a little bit less than a dollar. The balloon was a dollar. So this this right here goes about for about $20. Took us about 8 or $7 to make in total. We keep reusing these things because they're so good to use. It makes it look so beautiful automatically. And as again, we use uh, something for the base, right? So we take the boxes, like we get trolley boxes or whatever your boxes you're not selling out of it that you're already sold. You put it in there and then cover up the bottom with tissue paper or something nice, right? Something festive for uh, Valentine's Day, you know, that similar color. And then you just put it on top because you're selling the top of it to display. It's really easy to sell, guys. It's super easy to make. This one behind me was the first one we made. As you see, it looks, oh my God, hopefully it doesn't fall. Oh yeah, we're good. Uh, we put a little teddy bear in there. Uh, we got some M&Ms, some strawberry we decorated along the side. And the way we did this was we just got the strawberry and hot glued it to the bag. You know, just around, just the size. We got a Twix. We got Snickers, we got the little caramel thing again, and some miniature Starburst with some uh, bracelets, some, uh, those type of bracelets. But guys, this, we sell this for $20, I already sold this. Um, so all this stuff, we probably sold four of them. We need to go collect some more orders. Well, we sold, we sold a good amount of it. I'm giving some of them away for free too, just to thank my customers. Um, and you know, just, you know, one of them might be from a mom, we never know, but uh, guys, Valentine's Day is a special day. I just wanted to thank you for joining this video. Uh, if you guys, if you guys want to learn more about how to make these or you got any more questions, you can always comment down below or reach out to me on Instagram at the Candy King. Sorry, this video came so post late because I thought about the idea literally like two days the week of Thank, uh, not Thanksgiving, the week of Valentine's Day. So I only have one day to sell these. So if I would have started on Monday instead of Tuesday, See, I started them, I, I made them on Tuesday, right? And I didn't start advertising them till that night.
or that morning of Wednesday. So today is Wednesday, so I didn't even sell any money. I just collected money today. And literally, I'm bringing them to school. No, today's Thursday. So I sold them Wednesday, collect the money today. Yeah, I started Wednesday. So if I was starting Monday, I would have been able to sell way more. But I had literally one day to sell these. So that's why I start earlier. Probably like a week in advance. But guys, uh, I want to thank you for watching this video. As always, like, subscribe, and peace out till next time, guys. Whoa, 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 stop. This is not another ad. But, but guys, I want you to go ahead and click the link in the description below right now because right now you can get on a VIP waiting list for the new course that I am about to drop coming soon. There's be more information about the people it's helped, how it's increasing sales, you know, a lot of different things that you're going to want to know about. And if you really think my content has helped you and you want to get more, you know, take it to the next level and really break that $100 a day mark or just find out some other things that's really going to help you take your snack selling to the next level, go ahead and click that link the description below and i'll be sending something to your inbox pretty soon go ahead guys